the secret to a long, successful career. Uh, I would share first off our, our core values, service for self, excellence in all we do, and, and integrity. So the Air Force expects a certain quality of individual, and that's very, real simple as far as integrity and, and who we are. Our service for self, the Air Force will ask you to do certain things that some things might take you out of your comfort zone, but believe it or not, it grows you. It makes you a better person, a better airman to be able to contribute to all the priorities in which we have in our service. And then lastly, excellence. I mean, excellence, when you think about it. You know, what do we stand for? Are you the best that you can possibly be? Are you putting forth the best that you possibly can? And believe it or not, uh, those folks who don't focus on themselves but focus on a bigger and broader picture are the ones that do exceptionally, exceptionally well. So we're a team sport. You know, it's not just about us. It's about all of us together. And that's what makes us very, very successful. I'm very fortunate to serve as a command unit leader for NATO's Allied Command Transformation. You know, and our mission is about the peace, security, and territorial integrity of all of our 29 nations, our partner nations. So I'm very, very proud to have been grown throughout our Air Force at every level that you possibly can. Our training, our exercise, and our experiences really do matter. And I'm a recipient of that. So to get the opportunity to serve in a senior leadership position as a United States Airman and represent not just our nation, but represent our service means a lot. So tonight at our Chief's Recognition Ceremony, it means a lot to me to be able to share some of our experiences that I've had the privilege, because one day it's my hope that one of those chiefs that are sitting out there will replace me. And that's a success.